This year at the Leadership in Action Conference we have 78 delegates. They've come together as leaders within the Town and Parish Council movement and those who aspire to become leaders within our movement to learn from each other, from good practice and to hear from external experts. And it's aimed at any clerk who wishes to fall into the category of a leader. There are a certain number of challenges that are facing parish and town councils at the moment which actually affect the whole of local government. The case studies are excellent to hear because that gives you quite a lot of confidence to think well if that area can do that that's something that I can take back and think about for my council. The updates for legislation, risk assessments, insurance are always valuable. I think conference is a great time for networking and there's lots of time over coffee breaks and lunch to chat with colleagues about what you've heard in the sessions and to chat with the exhibitors too. I think they add value to conference and it's always useful to pick up some contact details. Well, the highlights from this conference have included Jim Graham, the inspirational Chief Executive of Warwickshire County Council, and we've also heard from the government uh, experts looking at the issue of devolution, and we've had an inspirational uh, presentation from Professor Colin Copus, one of the leading academic experts in the world of local government. There is a lot of political resistance in the Westminster classes to cede more power and autonomy to local decision makers. What we were seeing in the media was lots of negativity, whilst there were pockets of incredible positivity, lots of success stories, and those weren't being shared. So we measure the intellectual value we deliver to the team, we measure the emotional value, and then the financial value. The financial is an outturn an outcome of people doing what difference today is that we've had experts in their field speaking but then there's been practical sessions afterwards with case studies um, and very much you know the practical aspects of, of actually putting what the experts have told us into practice um, back in our own towns and, and then the chance to network and discuss what we've learned about there's a wealth of experience uh, in the audience at the conference as well as talking to speakers afterwards um, and I think that's something that really is it adds to the vibrancy of our sector to get this sort of conference going. I've certainly been very interested with the presentation today and I've learned a lot and I think uh, other clerks could also learn from this conference. The topics and the programme is definitely relevant to a larger council uh, but it, I think it's also relevant to a forward-thinking proactive council. Um, I found this one very very informative it's a good opportunity to meet with colleagues of bigger councils especially and to share common uh, problems and find out what their answers and solutions are. When I've gone back to report each year on, on what I've learned and what the council benefits each year from coming, they are actually quite supportive of me being able to come each year. It's been very good, everyone's very friendly, they've made me feel very welcome at my first uh, Leadership in Action conference.